What is going on guys? I am Jehovah and I am excited to share with you something that is uh, really, really cool to me and hopefully um, to you guys too, but it, it makes me feel really, really good um, about myself and just about the holidays and just doing something good always uh, can really, really make yourself feel good. Um, so basically what's going on guys? This Saturday we are going to have a charity stream, okay? And basically in this charity stream what is going to happen is I'm going to play games. Uh, first of all, I'll say right up front, it should be at least noon central time. That's 12 central time, okay, and then to 5 o'clock. At least that long and that time frame, right? It might go a little bit earlier, might go a little bit later, I don't know. Um, make sure you're following me on social media, Twitter, um, that, you know, that's always a good way to to know exactly when I'm streaming no matter what. But it should be at least noon to five this Saturday. Uh, so I wanted to give you guys plenty of time to get ready and, and be there and check it out if you're interested. So um, anyways, what the stream is gonna be is basically I'm just gonna stream for that amount of time and any donation that I get in that uh, during that stream, um, it is all, 100% of the donations will be going to a, a charity called Toys for Tots. Um, and this isn't something that they like reached out to me. I get reached out to by a lot of um, charities and I'm always like super skeptical even if I've heard of them because I'm like, I don't know, you know, the person emailing me could be, you know, who knows? There's all kinds of like situations where things could just be taken advantage of and lots and lots of money of mine or your all's could be, you know, going to something that's not an honest cause or just, I don't know, they just scares me. So I've never really done charity streams. But then last year I started this, um, I did the first one last year and it was very last minute. I just, you know, it was kind of a random thought in the back of my head and, and one day I decided the day I, uh, the day that I actually did it, that I was going to actually do it. Like it, the thought was there, but I, had, you know, I didn't prepare for it. I didn't really plan for it or anything. And one day I was just like, screw it, I'm gonna do it tonight. I went live, and this was back whenever I was streaming on MLG.TV. My viewership was really slow, was really low, excuse me, and uh, a lot lower than what it is on Twitch. And it turned out awesome. Um, everybody that found out about it was, you know, really excited, and everybody was kind of like sharing it on social media and, and trying to help me out. And the stream ended up, we ended up with over uh, two thousand dollars, about two thousand one hundred dollars um, by the end of the stream, donated in total. And that was unbelievable. That was crazy. I was super, super happy with that, obviously. And my wife and I were actually so excited about it that we immediately went to the store right after the stream was done. I remember. Um, and it was me and her and her mom was even there and we filled uh, three shopping carts full of toys at our local Walmart and um, had to go back. I think it ended up being like five or six shopping carts like literally completely full like overflowing with toys that we bought with the donation money and we loaded them up and took them all to uh, Toys for Tots. If you guys don't know what Toys for Tots is, it's basically an organization that you, I don't know if you can actually donate cash or not, I'm not really sure, but I just like the idea of, the idea of Toys for Tots is basically that you donate toys. Like a lot of times you'll see a drop box outside of um, whatever your shopping center is or inside the shopping center or whatever, and the idea is do your holiday shopping and you know if you can afford to, whatever, buy an extra toy, drop it into this collection box, and then they come and pick up the collection boxes and they get all these toys together and then people um, that are you know less fortunate and their families aren't very well off and they can't afford gifts for their children you know they make sure that those families are the ones that get these toys and no they're not going to get you know two thousand dollars worth of toys to one family that's not how it works um, they basically take all the toys donated and they make you know they divide them up and they they get toys out to kids that normally wouldn't get a toy for Christmas and like that thought to me is just terrible I, I can't I can't ugh, I can't fathom the idea of not getting a toy for Christmas as a child um, it's just you want to see kids happy on Christmas that's what the holidays are all about is is you know making kids happy it's such a really awesome time for kids and uh, just seeing the smiles from you know my family members uh, kids during the holidays is, is awesome and every kid deserves a toy on Christmas um, so you know I came from a family that didn't you know I came from a family that wasn't the most well-off you know we weren't dirt poor but 
Um, you know, the, pretty much Christmas was the only time of the year that I got anything. I was lucky to get anything um, other than on my birthday and Christmas. So, you know, I really, I understand the importance of that as a very young child. And like I said, I just don't like the idea of a kid waking up on Christmas morning and not having a toy. At least something, just something, you know, and it's, it's more the idea of it than the physical toy. It's just, yeah, I don't know, I'm ranting too long about that. But to me, it's something really, really cool. I felt so, so good about being able to donate um, that many toys. I, I put in my own money last year, too. I don't remember exactly how much we spent of our own money on toys, but we chipped in on top of that. And then, you know, some of my family members, when they heard about what we were doing, you know, my some of my family chipped in some money on top of that, too. And just every little bit counts, and it's really awesome, and it's, it's really cool to be in a position where I can do something like that. So, anyways, once again, this Saturday, noon to 5, at least, every single donation that I receive during the stream... We are going to take all of that, that money and we are going to spend it all on toys. And we are going to take all of that to Toys for Tots. Um, and a lot of people have been really looking forward to this. And I'm hoping we have an even better turnout than last year. And uh, I am really excited about it. You know, my wife and I, we already spent uh, $500 of our own money. And we have all of those toys ready to go. And we're just going to add everything that we buy from the donation money to that collection and take it all in at once and uh, it's gonna be pretty impressive I'll make a final video you know with like a number amount of how much we raised and a picture of all the toys or a video of all the toys um, because I like to s I like you guys say if you contribute I like to see I like to see you guys be able to see what that money actually went to um, I don't want anybody to feel like I'm trying to scam you or anything like that um, there's, there's, there's no, there's no need for any of that. Like I said, the, I'll link the video from last year with the $2,100, um, worth of toys. It's pretty impressive just to see that much toys. It's, it's pretty crazy. Um, but yeah, so that, oh, and also, um, so this year, like I said, last year was like not organized or whatever. I reached out to like a lot of the sponsors that I worked with this year and there's going to be a lot of cool stuff. Um, that I'm acquiring from a lot of my sponsors, a lot of stuff as a YouTuber, streamer, internet personality, whatever you want to call it, I get sent stuff all the time from companies, right? Like, you know, just whether it be shirts or merchandise or whatever, I have stuff everywhere and it drives my wife crazy. She's always like, you need to get rid of this stuff. You need to like give it away on stream, do it, whatever. And I, I do give stuff away on streams all the time, but I still have stuff. But anyways, I went through um, all the stuff in my office. I'm kind of looking around. I have Corsair products. Uh, I, I have keyboards, uh, headsets, uh, mice. I have, what else do I have? I have a bunch of control freaks. I have uh, some of my limited edition shirts that aren't even available for purchase anymore. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm sidearmsing. I'm choking on air. Um, some of my limited edition shirts and hoodies that you that aren't available for purchase anymore, like uh, triple cone shirt and hoodies, uh, the gold cone hoodie, um, the the Jehovah King shirt. Uh, I have a bunch of that stuff laying around. I even have a pair of Gunner optics that have been sitting on my shelf for like I don't even know how long. Um, you know, some old, I found, I was just going through my games on my shelf and I still had uh, a couple, I had like GTA 5 and one of the older Call of Duties still in the plastic wrapper and I was like, what? I don't know, I don't even know why I have this. So I just acquired everything that I have um, because somebody will appreciate that stuff. And then like I said, you know, I'm going to get more stuff from a lot of the sponsors that I work with. I've talked to uh, ProMods, my controller sponsor, we should have some sort of a controller um, you know, we should have some more Control Freak prizes coming out. Uh, I've even reached out to like Microsoft to see if I can get um, some download codes for some games or maybe, you know, DLC for some games or just whatever I can get. I've reached out uh, to a lot of companies, even talked to Warheads and Warheads I think is going to send out a bunch of uh, candy and stuff like that to give away. So basically the idea is I'm going to find out some way to do it. And I don't even know exactly how I'm going to do it, if it's going to be like a tier-based thing, like on amounts of donations or, uh, you know, like dollar amount. I, I don't know, but I'm going to try to give back as much stuff to the people who donate that I possibly can. Um, and, yeah, I just thought, you know, last year it was really awesome seeing everybody really come together and donate a whole hell of a lot of money and, uh, you know, be able to buy a bunch of toys with that. And I just thought this year if I could give back as much as I can um, to the people that donate, that would be awesome. I, obviously, I'm not going to have, like, a prize or anything for every single donation, but I'm going to try to do as much as I can. Uh, and then I'm going to be shipping out a metric ton of things, uh, which is going to be crazy. But, yeah, 
So I think I've pretty much covered everything. Uh, we raised $2,100 last year. Um, we're gonna do it, we're doing it again this year. We're gonna see how much we can raise. We're gonna buy all the toys with all the donation money, and then take all that to Toys for Tots. And uh, that is this Saturday, noon to five at least. And we're giving away a lot of cool stuff to the people that do donate. So um, you know, and I understand if you're listening to this and you're like, man, I just can't donate. You know, I don't have the money. No big deal. Don't worry about it. But if you can, it would be much appreciated. Uh, just think about think about your you know five dollar donation or even your dollar donation whatever all of it contributes. Just think about that little chip chip in of money you know going towards a toy that is going to make a kid smile on Christmas morning that normally wouldn't have had a Christmas gift. And to me, that's all the reason in the world to donate. But once again, if you do not have the money to donate, no hard feelings. Don't beat yourself up about it. Um, you know, that's that's one of the reasons we're doing this is for people that are less fortunate, you know, we're going to help out as much as we can and so lucky to be in a position where we can even have that opportunity. So anyways, guys, I've been rambling on and on and on and on, but I think it's awesome to give kids uh, toys for Christmas that normally wouldn't have gotten them. And uh, it feels good to help out, especially around the holidays. So I love you guys. Make sure you're at the stream um, Saturday noon to five. Central time. Central. Central. I love you guys. I'll see you there. We're going to be playing some cool games. I forgot to mention that. What games we're going to be playing. We're probably going to be playing Black Ops 3. Um, maybe even a little Fallout 4. I don't There's so many games out right now. I can't even like keep my head straight. It's insane. But I don't know. Uh, definitely Black Ops 3. Maybe some other stuff. We'll just see. Anyways, see you guys there. I love you. Merry Christmas. Ho happy holidays. Early. I know. It's only like November 10th. But it's coming. It's almost here. I love you.